gorgeous dress that Josh bought for me. It was supposed to be a Christmas present, but he got really excited and frustrated because he couldn't wrap it. And so he gave it to me early yesterday. It's from BBC Hot Topic Collection. Uh, it's a size large, and I could have actually gone medium. I went large just to be safe, but um, it's not tight fitting. It's a really soft, soft crushed velvet. It's got this cute little collar. I'm not really a fan of collars, but it suits this dress. Got a little mesh. It reminds me of the green, um, the green bones dress that I have. Everybody seems to have. And um, it's got this gorgeous night sky background with the TARDIS over here. Um, this is a spectacular dress, especially in person. Even Josh is like, wow, that's really well made. The velvet is so incredibly soft. Back in my early goth days, all I wore were velvet dresses, and I grew out of that. <laughs> I haven't worn velvet in quite some time. But um, this dress, this dress is just beautiful. I will do a try on in a little while. I love that it's got a high, it's got a high waist, so it hides the tummy bulge <laughs> or whatever. Um, it's a princess waist, so your boobs sit about here, and um, this is above your waist. Your natural waist on this dress is probably closer to, I'd say, around here ish so it's like princess cut it's right under the bust line I know it probably doesn't look like it but it is it's a very high waist and um, I think it ends around my knee so I will go take a shower and then I'll come back and try this on for you guys and see what you think it's I'm like this is all I thought about last night god I want to get up and I want to make this video it's actually very heavy too it's a really good quality um, I'm gonna go ahead and show this as well I, I would have shown it by now in other videos but the day of the crash, he bought this for me. This was from Walmart. It was like seven bucks, but I desperately wanted this. It's a very similar design. And because um, in, in New Zealand, anything with Doctor Who, it's just a picture of the TARDIS on its own. You don't really get these pretty backgrounds as such. And um, in this one you do. So this is a gorgeous shirt. The background is so pretty. It would be even better if it glowed in the dark, but <laughs> that's all right. I was so in awe when I saw this shirt. I was just like, oh my God, I want it, I want it, I want it. And um, I'm not sure if I can put this on for you guys. I, I put it on once, but my my rib hurts so much. It's really hard for me to lift my arms above my head. So if I can do it to put the shirt on, I'll do a try on after I shower as well. This is the gorgeous Doctor Who shirt. I was able to put it on for you guys. Very, uh, I mean, this is a medium and it's not skin tight. Um, it's a bit tight against the chest. My boobs are quite a bit bigger for some reason lately. Um, but uh, this is a beautiful, beautiful shirt as you can see. It's, but, um, it's just such a striking design. It's really nice. It goes down to, probably I'd say, this is my waist right there. So it goes down to about crotch level on me for medium. So the fit is really good. The quality is really good. It's not like a really thin shirt. You can feel the prints on it. It does feel like it would last through lots of washings. I haven't had a lot of experience with Walmart shirts in quite some time. I don't think I've ever bought a shirt from Walmart. <laughs> But this one and the It shirt that we got are just spectacular quality for seven dollars. It's just I still can't believe how cheap things are here. So I'm gonna go and put on the dress for you guys and let you see that. I might try on the It shirt as well because a lot of people have seen it on him kind of when he's turned sideways with me in photos. They haven't actually seen it like full frontal. So while I'm here hurting myself anyway, I'm just gonna go and try on that shirt and show you guys. Here's the. Pennywise shirt, the It shirt. This is the original Pennywise, and it says they all float down here. Now, I've got another It shirt that I got when I was with Logan, and I ordered that online from Facebook, and it costs about $50. And the quality of those shirts is nowhere near as good as the quality of this. This is like his face directly printed on it. Um, this is such an eye-catching shirt. I really, really love 
love this shirt. And this is also size medium. Um, anybody who has seen this shirt on Josh has said, wow, that's a beautiful shirt. And I can, of course, see why. It's just like I said, I don't wear t-shirts out. One day maybe I will, and I don't want to pass up the chance to get these amazing shirts, especially $7, especially from Walmart. This is the absolutely beautiful dress that Josh bought me. There's the collar, as you can see, very similar to the green and black dress that I have. Um, very, very similar design, except this waistband goes right under your boobs. Now, if I was flatter on top, this waistline might be a bit lower, but I'm not. Well, especially not right now, so it's quite high. Now, there are two things. Well, there's something I like and something I don't like about this dress. What I do like is that the waistband is high, and it does hide if you've got bloating or whatever. I don't know why the camera's trying not to focus. Um, this is the whole thing, by the way. And it's kind of like this cute little princessy kind of dress. It's really adorable. It's really little girl looking. What I don't like is that it also makes you look quite chunky. Now, I'm by no means skinny, so you can stop right there. Uh, but as you saw with the t-shirt earlier that was more tight fitting to my body, I haven't actually put on all that much weight. I've put on a little bit of weight. Something's going on with me. My, my fucking tits are gigantic. I've got swelling from the accident. Um, I know my whole hip on this side is swollen. I've got lumps in my back and I've got like lumps right here from my kidney and liver damage. So I'm, I am bloated. I am swollen. This makes me feel very fat, like very fat. <laughs> I do not like how fat it makes me feel like just, it's like a pregnancy dress almost. So I probably wouldn't wear it until I trim down a little bit, but see like my ribs are right here. There's, I don't have any more, you know, I don't have any meat to lose over my ribs. This is my bone right there. It's not rolls of fat or anything. And um, anything else that's fat is hidden by the dress. So I don't really understand what's going on here. How, you know, I mean, my hips could do with a little bit of mushing down. But even so, the weight comes from right here. The weight look comes from right here. As does because I've got these things going on at the moment. Um, but, hey, you know, it, it'll hide everything. I'll just you know, maybe you learn to accessorize or something, but it is, it is really nice. It feels really good. I love the way it feels. I love the design. I love the way it looks. And, um, this is just a really nice gesture. It's really nice. A little brat left the fucking price tag on it as well, but, um, I'm still so happy with this dress. I wanted it so badly. Um, it is quite stretchy, so it's still, you know, it's still loose. It's just tight across my tits, but the rest of it, it's not, like, it's not tight at all. I could have gone to a medium, believe it or not. I know it might not look that way, but it could have gone to a medium. And uh, I can easily just stick my, my fingers in it. There. There's a lot of room, a lot of room. So I'm not, not too sure. See, if I were to tighten it like that... You know where my my body actually is it's not too bad it's just i think it's my boobs that's doing it honestly there's nothing i can do about that right now this would make a great maternity dress i tell you that much because you could just croak and you'd be walking around looking cute as hell just a thought but uh yeah what do you guys think isn't it fucking adorable it's so cute Sorry for the non-flatteringness on my own body, but I don't care. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. And you know what? With a hoodie or something to hide, you know, this bit, it would still look excellent. So you know what? No, I am going to wear it. I don't care. And if anybody doesn't like it, they can kiss my fat ass. <laughs> Josh bought it for me, and he thinks it's cute, and I think it's cute. And uh, I'm super happy. It was very, very sweet of him.